Wizard's Doll. Item number, SCP-2016. Object class, safe. Special Containment Procedures SCP-2016-1 is to be kept in a standard containment locker at Site-20. Testing with SCP-2016 must be approved by at least one Level 2 researcher. SCP-2016-1 must be inspected monthly for repairs. Description SCP-2016-1 is a knitted doll resembling a human male with a long white beard and dark green robes, measuring approximately 32 centimeters in height. When humans enter REM sleep within 3 meters of SCP-2016-1, they will experience vivid dreams. In addition to this, subjects will also usually encounter SCP-2016-2. SCP-2016-2 appears as an elderly human male with the same appearance as SCP-2016-1. It is always capable of understanding the language spoken by the dreamer, though it is not capable of verbal communication. These dreams always end with SCP-2016-2 handing the subject a piece of chalk and creating a wall, while motioning for the subject to draw a rectangle with a circle inside on the surface of the wall. If the subject attempts to draw the shape indicated in the dream on the surface of a wall, Within seven days of having the dream, the drawing will transform into a door with a round handle. If the subject opens the door, it leads to an open meadow with a stone tower located a varying distance away. There will be a paper attached to the tower's door saying, To my new apprentice, in the subject's native language. Said tower's floors contain several libraries and laboratories. All subjects who have used these facilities have died in their sleep within five years. Cause of death is unknown, but all subjects have been reported to release a gaseous mass from their mouths, which disappears seconds later. Video surveillance shows an elderly, translucent human male, similar to SCP-2016-1 and SCP-2016-2, approaching the sleeping subjects and absorbing the gaseous mass into his hand. Authorized personnel may refer to Exploration Log 2016 for further details about the tower. Level 2 access is required to view the unabridged log.